वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल जे बी आर ऑनलाइन क्लासेस लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल सो हेलो एवरी वन इन दिस वीडियो एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट एक्सरसाइज नाइनटीन पॉइंट टू फ्रॉम द बुक ऑफ एम एल अगरवाल सो हियर द फर्स्ट प्रॉब्लम फॉर द प्रीवियस चैप्टर और द अदर्स चैप्टर प्लीज चेक द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स द लिंक विल बी दियर so here the first problem that is draw the graphs of the following linear equation uh, okay and these graphs will be not accurately like the graph paper here i am just going to uh, show you how to draw the graphs in the graph paper okay so here 2x plus y plus 3 that equal to 0 is your first linear equation so from that you can write y equal to minus 2x minus 3 okay so now you have to find out three coordinate to draw the line so as here y equal to minus 2x minus 3 that means the value of y is depend on the value of x so as here if x equal to 0 okay suppose here x equal to 0 then the value of y will be minus 3 in this way you have to form another two points so here next one if y equal to sorry x equal to 1 if x equal to 1 then it will be minus 2 into 1 minus 3 that means minus 5 and the last one if y equal to minus 1 okay sorry x equal to minus 1 then it will be plus 2 minus 3 and it will be also minus 1 okay so that means here the coordinates will be 0 minus 3 then 1 minus 5 and the last one will be minus 1 minus 1 okay now with the help of these three coordinates you have to draw the straight lines so as here 0 minus 3 okay so this one will be 0 then 1 2 3 4 5 here minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 minus 5 1 2 3 4 5 and here also minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 minus 4 minus 5 okay now 0 minus 3 so here 0 and then y minus 3 that means in this point so that equal to 0 minus 3 now next one 1 minus 5 so 1 means x this one and then again minus 5 okay so minus 5 means this point so here that is 1 minus 5 Now the last point that is minus one minus one. So here minus one and then again minus one. That means that point. Okay. Now if you join, okay. Now if you join these three point, then you will get your straight lines. So that is your straight line. So this is the first point. You have to mark the point in this way, and write down the coordinate in beside of the point. Okay, so here minus one minus one zero minus three and one minus five. So that is your graph. Now the second one x minus five y minus four that equal to zero. So from that x equal to five y plus four. So now here the value of x now depends on y. So if y equal to zero, then x equal to four. Okay, and next if y equal to minus one. Then it will be minus five plus four, and that equal to again minus one. Okay, and now the next, if here y equal to one, then it will be five plus four, and that equal to nine. And now next, if y equal to minus two, then it will be five into Minus two that equal to minus ten. So minus ten plus four that equal to minus six. So now here are the three coordinates: four zero, minus one minus one, and next one minus six minus two. Okay. So now four zero. So four zero will be here one two three four. So that one. Next point will be minus one minus one. That means that point. And third one will be minus six. So as here minus five. So it will be minus six. And then minus two. That means this point. So now you have to join these three point. Okay. 
so first point this one second point and this one third point now you have to write down the coordinates here 4 comma 0 it will be minus 1 minus 1 and last one will be minus 6 minus 2 so this line is for the second graph now sum number 3 draw the graph 5x plus 6y minus 30 that equal to 0 and use it find the area of the triangle formed by the line and the coordinate axis so as here 5x plus 6y minus 30 so you can write this one 5x equal to 30 minus 6y and from that one x equal to 30 minus 6y by 5 now you have to make this one you know that so here x by y so here the value of x is depend on y so if y equal to 0 then 6 into 0 0 so 30 by 5 and that equal to 6 now the next one if y equal to here 4 so 6 4 is a 24 so 30 minus 24 that equal to 6 so 6 by 5 that equal to 1.2 so now the last one if y equal to 5 then 6 into 5 30 so 30 minus 30 that equal to 0 5 0 by 5 that equal to 0 okay so now here the first point 6 0 so that one 6 0 then 1.24 so 1.2 will be here then 4 will be here and then 0 5 so 0 5 means this point okay so now you have to join these three lines sorry these three points okay so that means this is your triangle okay this one this one is your triangle and you have to find out the area of this triangle okay so here as you know this is a right angle triangle so the area of this triangle will be half into base into height so in that case here this one is the base 1 2 3 4 5 6 so 6 unit is the base so half into 6 and height will be here 1 2 3 4 5 so 5 will be height so 6 cancel out with 3 that equal to 15 square units okay so 15 square units is your answer now next one sum number 5 because sum number 4 is as same as sum number 3 so I hope you can solve it so here in sum number 5 draw the graph of the equation and here the equation is y equal to 3x minus 4 okay and find graphically the value of y when x equal to minus 1 and also the value of x when y equal to 5 so that means first you have to draw the graph so first you have to find out three coordinates points so draw like this way so x y as here x equal to 0 if x equal to 0 then 3 into 0 it's 0 so it will be minus 4 then if x equal to 1 then 3 minus 4 it's minus 1 and last one if here x equal to 2 then 3 into 2 6 6 minus 4 that equal to 2 okay so now you have to plot these points so 0 minus 4 okay so here 0 and minus 4 will be that point now next one 1 minus 1 so here 1 and this one here 1 and minus 1 this point this is the second one third one here 2 and that one will be 2 so this is the third point now you have to join these lines so whenever you join these three points you get these straight lines okay so now mark the point okay now you have to also write down the coordinates here so it will be 0 minus 4 this one 1 minus 1 and this one 2 2 okay now next thing you have to find out the value of y when x equal to minus 1 so as here when x equal to minus 1 okay when x equal to minus 1 then the value of y will be as here minus 1 here so now you have to find out the intersecting point here okay you have to find out the intersecting point here so as this one will be 6 then definitely this one will be here 7 okay and the intersecting point as this one equal to minus 1 so definitely if you join it by a mark line then it will be here as the intersecting point so when x equal to minus 1 
then y equal to minus 7 okay and the next one the value of x when y equal to 5 so as here y equal to 5 means 1 2 3 4 5 so this one equal to 5 y equal to 5 okay and then here x equal to as if you join this one by and then the intersecting point will be you have to draw like this way okay by the dotted line so here the intersecting point so the intersecting point here that equal to 3 so that means this point equal to 5 comma 3 so here if x equal to sorry y equal to 5 then x equal to 3 as your answer you can also check it by put down the value in this equation so as here x equal to minus 1 so it will be minus 1 that means 7 so your answer will be correct next one as x equal to 3 so 3 3 9 9 minus 4 that equal to 5 so it's also correct now next sum number 6 so here in sum number 6 graph a linear equation in x and y passes through 4 0 so that is the 4 0 point and 0 3 and that one is the 0 3 point now you have to find out the value of k if the graph passes through k comma 1.5 that means here the coordinate of y equal to 1.5 so this one equal to 1 and this one equal to 2 so 1.5 will be in between of them and if you join a line here then you have got this intersecting point okay so this is the intersecting point of x and y axis and according to my diagram this one will be 1 and this one will be 2 this one 3 and 4 so it will be here 2 comma 1.5 that means the value of k equal to 2 if y equal to 1.5 so now this is the last sum for this video here sum number 7 use the table given alongside with the draw the graph of a straight line so here 1 minus 2 2 b 3 4 and a minus 5 you have to find out the value of a and b so as here 1 minus 2 so here this one will be 1 and minus 2 that means that point so it is 1 minus 2 and the next point will be 3 4 so as here 1 2 3 and 4 will be here so next point will be here 3 4 okay so now you have to join and here the next one that is y y x equal to 2 okay and y equal to don't know the value of the point b so now join these two points so now this is the line so here now you have to find out the value of b so if x equal to 2 then this one will be the intersecting point and that one is the value of y so here that equal to 1 so this point equal to 2 1 that means value of b equal to 1 and next one here x equal to a then y equal to minus 5 so as y equal to minus 5 1 2 3 4 minus 5 so this point equal to y equal to minus 5 and here x equal to 0 so that is the point 0 minus 5 that means the value of x equal to 0 so value of a equal to also 0 so b equal to 1 and a equal to 0 is your answer